Would you like to know about trastuzumab and tansine chemo preparation? Some key points to keep in mind while preparing the dose. First point, products are not interchangeable, meaning don't use different brands preparing the same dose. Second point, trastuzumab and tansine can cause liver damage, so keep a close eye on the patient's liver enzymes. Also cardiac damage to be expected, so keep an eye on the ventricular ejection fraction. As for trastuzumab and tansine dosage, general dosing is 3.6 mg per kilogram every 3 weeks. It's easy to remember. And no dosage adjustment for renal patients, however as mentioned before, it can cause damage to the liver, so either reduce the dose or discontinue depending on the damage level done to the patient's liver. Some infusion reactions are documented with few cases. If it happened, then either stop the infusion or set the rate as slow as possible. Infusions should be over 90 minutes for the first dose, and if the patient tolerated the dose, then infusion for the following doses can be over no less than 30 minutes. However, I always advise our nursing staff to always go for the 90 minutes. Depending on the reaction type of the reaction severity, the dose should be decreased and patient status is to be monitored. As mentioned, the regular dose is 3.6 mg per kilogram. If this dose induced some reaction slash toxicity, next dose should be 3 mg per kilogram, and the following dose is 2.4 mg per kilogram if another reaction took place with the first dose adjustment. However, if the reaction still not controlled with the second dose reduction, the treatment should be discontinued and alternative therapy should be pursued. Now let's review trastuzumab and tansine and drug volume optimization. The products doesn't contain preservatives. Reconstituted vials are stable for 24 hours in the fridge. Same for final solutions, the mentioned stability includes infusion time. There is no displacement volume, so use 5 ml sterile water for injection for 100 mg vials and 8 ml for 160 mg vials. Final concentration would be 20 mg per milliliter. Final solution is crystal clear, like water, there is no particles in it. Only use saline, trastuzumab and tansine isn't compatible with D5 water. Nursing tips. Check the patient for allergic reaction. Review the labs for liver enzymes. Monitor symptoms for heart failure.